If anything goes wrong with the kiln while you're firing, the controller will shut down. But it's very clever, the controller, and it will analyse what has gone wrong with the kiln or itself and will come up with the appropriate error messages. If you look in your owner's handbook, there is a whole array of error messages which all mean something different. And it's important when you get an error message to write it down. Everybody is upset when they get an error message and the first thing you do is to turn the kiln off. If you do that, you lose the error message and then when you phone up your supplier engineer, um, he'll ask you what the problem is and then if you can't remember what the problem really is and have to guess it, he may bring the wrong spares along. So always write down the error signal before you switch it off. I can simulate one error that you might get, let's say a broken thermocouple. So I can just disconnect this. Okay, now we've got a bust thermocouple and immediately the kiln switches off and this is the message that comes up. And if you look up in your book, hey presto, thermocouple broken. So write that down and then switch her off.